my homies, they ain't matter How'd you treat the game like a setup? How'd you switch lanes like a fed up? Never take a bitch away, you lay up All these bitches easy like a lay up Yeah, she look good, but she has nothing going I swear that it felt like the first day of summer But that's when you know I'll be showing Yo, Ewall, what's the word, bro? This Truth Teller from We Are The Truth Tellers. Truth Teller, what's the word, man? How you feeling, bro? Man, I'm coolin', bro. I appreciate you letting me chop it up with you again. Man, Joe, no problem, man. No problem, man. You know it's always love with you, bro. Man, big guy, I seen you recently working hard, man. It seemed like everybody in the music business rocking with you. But it was one particular picture I seen that kind of looked at a little uh, memorabilia to me. I seen you had met A.R. Av. How was that? Got my shot town nigga in Ewan. Stand up nigga. South Philly Zone Teeth. No question. In the building. Legendary. Uh, and then, you know, I have this little organic, you know, little street niggas punching at each other. We don't even have the same words. So it's as if we already met before we even met. Oh, uh, yeah, I didn't know that. I thought that was like your first time meeting them. No, no, no. It was his first time, but what I'm saying is, you know. Real niggas understand each other, so it's just... It's, it's, oh, okay. Each other. <laughs> right, I see that, bro. You know, I hear a lot of rumors that, you know, um, well, you get love in the city, too, but I hear once you leave the city, you get super, super love. Is that true? Well, definitely. Yeah, yeah. You know, you know, you know how to tell them that, you know, we are uh, with your side of the party. You know, we're very uh, influential. So, you know, everyone wants to do Right, bro. You know, I seen you posted a video today. I ain't gonna lie. It was kind of controversial if you ask me, bro. You had posted a video today. I guess you was rolling up and you kind of made some comments about the issue with J-Rock or something like that. Can we touch on that a little bit more? Uh, you know, really, you know, I don't go too deep in that, you know, things like that. I don't really speak too much on that shit. Right. That shit that be going on the internet. I don't, I don't really do the internet, but, you know, I just been realizing and notice that lately, like, a lot of people that stay, you know what I'm saying, track, talk about we killed J. Rockin', so I won't kill J. Rockin'. Right. Man, so I got to put my name, man, keep my name out that shit. Right. Man, I was, man the streets of the streets, man, I ain't killed nobody. I did not kill anyone. <laughs> I never killed anyone. Right. I sure said that video, and I thought that... It was crazy. Bro, I want to know something, Ewald. You know, uh, last year, Chicago kind of broke records for like a, a while, you know, over 700 some murders, over 300 some people already shot already, bro. Is the problem ever going to slow down? Uh, man, I hope it do. And, I, man, I pray God that it do. Yeah. My kids got to grow up there, so yeah, I hope so, man. It ain't looking like it right now, but man, you got to stay prayed up, man. Right. Bro, you know, I seen you with a song with Spenzo. I remember a little while ago, he kind of said some words about uh, Rico Reckless. Y'all work that out? Yeah, you know, we came together, man. You know, resolved the issues. And it's good music. Right, I see that, bro. Sometimes the media overhype shit like that, man. Is that true that the media overplay shit, bro? Sometimes they don't really be I issues. Don't you. you know that. Right. You know that. You know that. Right. Bro, what's your opinion on that Ramsey the Great situation? Because I seen you spoke out on that. Bro, I want to ask you something too. I ain't gonna lie. I don't, I don't want to Jimmy flick with you either, Ewald. Lately, uh, 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 it's been a small kind of issue going on. I've been seeing. I seen the video the other day with a guy from Detroit, a rapper by the name of SK Mikey. He had some not so nice words about Rico Reckless. I thought he was part of the crew. Me and my cousin, shit, nigga, and just me and my cousin. 
Right. But why do you why do you feel like the whole world is why why is the whole world so locked in on what's going on in Chicago, bro? Because I don't see no other markets. Is that what it is? It's not fake. Stop moving. Shit you see on the movies is happening in real life, and it, it, it amazes me. Like the shit that you see on the movies is happening in real life, and it, it, it amazes me. Right. But yeah, it can get real like that. Is it safe though, bro? When you in them other places and shit like that, do you feel you gotta watch over your shoulder and shit? Anywhere, right. you're not never safe anywhere. You could die anywhere. They could die everywhere. It's just in a greater place in Chicago. So I, I won't point everywhere I go. Right. But can I let my guard down a little bit more than Chicago? Yes, but I never let it all the way down anywhere. Period. Right. Hey, what's what's some upcoming artists need to do in this shit? Lost a couple homies, they ain't matter. How'd you keep the game like a setup? How'd you switch lanes like a fed up? Never take a bitch away, you lay up. All the bitches easy like a lay up. Yeah, she look good, but she has nothing going. I swear that it felt like the first day of summer, but that's when you know I'll be showing.